Kunis in Mount Kunis, and I um, frequent the diabetes clinic with Andrea and Lori and everyone here. They've just been helpful. They <laughs> just were there, will sit and watch me cry. The first year I came here, and it was like every three months, that I think I mostly just cried. <laughs> I can get very emotional. Um, it's because my mother died from it. It was 15 years ago, and they did, well, I don't think it was taken as seriously as it is now. It's like now people are understanding that it is, it's a serious disease. Well, first of all, with Lori having diabetes, that I think helps a lot. She's the nurse and stuff that works in the Diabetes Center. It's been easier to, to talk to someone that actually has an idea of what you're going through. I mean, it's one thing to know about it and um, to know what happens and, and stuff, but I think it's different to actually talk to someone who has it. And Andrea, being the nutritionist, um, it's just very good. I mean, she's very, very personable and just really, um, it's really great to talk to her. And she's always has some great information and um, this really helps you get through stuff. And I think just a lot of understanding. No matter how many questions I have, she answers everything. When I first found out, it was, um, so it was kind of shocking. So I think every, every time I, I came in, it's like, well, you know, how do you feel? And, and I'm like, I hate this. I just, I can't stand this. I can't. For the first couple of months, I wouldn't even check my blood. I was in denial. I just, I didn't want to do it. You know, if you, if you want to live, you kind of have to. When I first came in, and I think the first place I went to was, was the diabetes clinic. Um, and I just liked the whole way it was set up. I liked the people and just that it was informative. Um, and that everyone's willing to help and, um, you know, you can ask them questions, you can call them anytime, you can email them, you know, it just, just always seemed to, you know, be there. If, whatever you need, you know, they'll be there and try to help you through it. Everyone was just really good and, you know, it'll be okay and, you know, we'll, we'll all work together to get through it. And I've gotten a lot of good information and, or areas to go to get the information if I need it and tools to work with as far as, um, you know, like food diaries and exercise diaries, things like that to work out. It's been really helpful for me. Some days are a lot harder than others, but I think every day has gotten a little bit better. It's a, a really friendly atmosphere. It's, it's a comfortable place that you come into. It's, I'm glad people are taking the, the disease more seriously than I think they used to. Um, they have support groups. You can talk to people who, who understand what you're going through and, and stuff and um, will help in any way they can. It's just been a really great experience for me. I think it's just, it, it's helped an awful lot in trying to deal with it. and. I just wish there had been a group like this that my mother would have had access to because I think it would have made a big difference for her. But I'm just, I guess I'm just glad they have it now. <laughs>